Hello everyone, I'm SimonFX3, I've not seen you in ages, and today we are going to be doing a uh, unboxing of Halo 4 Limited Edition. Oh look, you can see me in the reflection. <laughs> I'm uh, calling the iPod Nano, no idea where the camera is. Yeah, Limited Edition. Alright. Right, so uh, I'm going to be using this pen knife to open it. Um, it's got Portugal written on it, you can't see that. Right, I've removed the cover, this video is a bit jumpy because my iPod is a very low battery. But I've taken off the cover and, um, well, sorry for the light in the corner. It's too, it's too dark without it. Back, that's cool, got some nice pictures on it. Sorry, it's a really bad unboxing, I haven't done videos in ages. Um, as I said, this is the limited collector's edition of uh, Halo 4. And you can see that's the, that's the box there. I'm just being patronising now. Um, that's some of the stuff you get, like the Fall to Dawn film, you get the full thing. The Reclaimer Saga begins, because they're going to make two more in the um, Reclaimer trilogy, they're calling it. Right, so now I've recharged my iPod a little bit more, so I can go for a little bit more. Um, a little bit more, what am I talking about? So here it says 195663. I presume this is common with all of them, all of the limited editions. Or um, it might actually be numbered, which would be cool. But um, you probably know the answer to that, so uh, tell me in the comments, why not? That'd be nice, if, um, if anyone's got a different number. Chances are that's all the same. Oh, and uh, first game made by 343 Industries, which is uh, which is nice. So the main housing of the box comes away, and this has all the back on it, and Halo 4 on the side. Right, so with the box, just on its own now, UNSC logo, all that jazz. Playing on the back, it's a pretty good cool box, and I think it opens magnetically. There we are. Ooh. It's inside. Let's get this stuff out. Sorry, I am going to have to use my other hand. There we are. Box used over there. Whoa. Let's get started on this. Well, first off in this pile, we have what appears to be the game case. And that looks incredibly cool. I'll just go through all this first, and then I'll um, I'll open them individually. So it's definitely the game case. This UNSC. Hmm, I don't know. CD set. Ah. So this is in the back. Gabriel Thorne Majolna Requisition. That looks like a poster of some kind. Um, another thing that looks... These look like moon food. I've never seen that. Like dehydrated food. Infinity. And that looks like a clipboard. Nice. So that's the five things that are contained in the limited edition. As I said, um, I'll open these shortly. Right, so first off, the uh, the Steelbook case. That's the see logo on the front and uh, header for on the side. Back's uh, plain. Let's just uh, flip this open, so I think this is the game case. Oh my god. That looks awesome. Inside it's got like nice detailing. Two discs, that's strange. Actually, um, Jack did tell me there were two discs. So yeah, wow. Master Chief on one and some kind of Promethean on the other. <laughs> basically this video, uh, just to warn you, I know I'm like halfway through, is basically just going to be me nerdgasming over this. <laughs> so yeah, sorry about that. Look at that, discs. Spinning. DJ style. No? Anyone? No. Okay. Sorry. So uh, moving on to what I'm going to call the red ration bag. It's one of those sort of little clippy open bags. I've already uh, clipped it open and can't see inside. So I'll just... I didn't just show the code. It's alright. I can edit. I can edit out bits. But that looks. That's pretty sweet. And the other two items in in this, in the red ration bag, are um all the pre-order bonuses. I'm not show you the backs. where all the codes are. Uh, special armor, assault rifle, emblem. Some Avatar stuff, specializations, and the free map packs, and it's a 14 day gold trial. So that's uh, some pretty cool stuff there. I'll be re redeeming those straight away. Well, maybe not the trial, because I've got, got gold, but put those, rest assured. And the other thing is just the like terms and conditions, and, you know, warranty and that. Right, we are back, and in better definition than before. Um, I've got a camera. Right, so this is um, another thing that comes with the. the Limited Collector's Edition. Um, another one of the bags, like you know this red bag, but this time it's silver. UNSC um, ration bags, I think I call them. And this one contains, if I can do it one-handed. Oh, that's kind of skilled. That's skilled. So you've got the little. You go here. Camera doesn't want to focus. It says uh, attention Spartan Gabriel Thorne, and it's like a mission statement. Mission briefing. Uh, 
additional support, airstrikes available, mission location. That's uh, that's very cool. I have to say, I think that's pretty cool. <laughs> Go on, why don't you stay down? Um, and that's all that's contained in the uh, so right. Penultimately, we have one of the coolest things you get with this, and that's it's a poster on spot on Gabriel Thorne. He was in. He's the one who all the stuff in here talks about. Not only players though, and um, it's got an overview of his armor, which is nice and cool. Um, talking on the warrior configuration, which is the armor configuration. A nice side view of the armor. And then some other helmets, and uh, there we have the EOD helmet. Best of the helmets, I think you'll find. It's definitely my favorite one. And there's you know, Scout, Orbital, Pathfinder. But anyway, it's a pretty awesome poster. It's definitely, uh, definitely going on my wall. And finally, we have this. This is a little clipboard. It says Infinity on it. Shoot. Not to get there, you can sort of see it. Kind of? Yeah, Infinity. Um, and it's like a flipbook. It contains some some letters. Things which I haven't had not had time to read yet. Schematics for some of the weapons. So there you have the saw. DMR, the sniper rifle. Sticky detonator, which is the magnum thing you see in the trailer. Um, ship, R&R, &R, opportunity schedule. Be good. Uh, 5k charity fun run. Poker night. You can't can't see those, but that's what it says. And there's more letters and there's some stuff in the back, which is just there. More letters. I've looked at them. But this this is cool. It's nice. It's got a nice sort of feel to it. It's it's good quality. So um, that rounds off everything you get. I think it comes in this very nice box. So you've got your clipboard. Just round off here. Oh, sorry. Your steel game case containing two discs, one for multiplayer content which you just install. Poster. Two bags, one containing all your free stuff, and one containing what was it? It was a mission statement, wasn't it? Yeah, it's a mission statement. And uh yeah, that's it. There's the five things you get. So I have to say, for what was it, ten pounds more than the than the standard edition, I'm pretty damn happy with that. Plus I mean this this free stuff that I get, plus the 90 minute film there's some armor, you know, some skins etc I've been through that earlier I think that's it's well worth £10 so I um, hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh, well there won't be more content like this probably but um, there's going to be Halo 4 content up from me, Will which is probably just us two, Rob might put something up and uh, there's Fred's Assassin's Creed 3 playthroughs coming on right now so if you're interested in that game uh, and you want to subscribe for that because they're they're pretty good. He's just getting deep into the story. Um, so that's about all for this. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you have, then please give it a like rating. Uh, if you didn't like it, then dislike it. I really don't mind. You know, feedback is important, even if it is negative. So yeah, if um, you know, I would like to invite you to subscribe, but of course I'm not begging. It's your own choice. So, well, thank you for thank you for watching this video of the unboxing of the limited collector's edition of Halo 4 produced by 343 Industries thank you for watching and goodbye I've been SummerFX3